What's going on, everybody? My name is George 2D, and welcome to Super Liminal, a game that's been recommended by one of my one of my followers. His name's Famous Duncan. Has been suggesting this game for a bit of time, and I apologize for being delayed. Albeit, I love games like this, Super Liminal, uh, Liminal Spaces, stuff like that. You've seen me play Animoiopolis. You've seen me play The Backrooms, other Liminal aesthetic games. Um, this came out back in 2019. It's a fairly old game, but um, I am excited to give it a try. And from what I can tell, it looks like there's a multiplayer. So that might be something I might be looking into in the future with a couple of other creators or a couple friends. Or might even be some followers. Who knows? Um, but for right now, let's get right into it. This is super liminal. Uh, let's get started. Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems what? to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent pending somnoscope technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary at the University Medical Center. Somnoscope okay. will make your dreams come true. All right. Okay. All right. Move this. W A S D. Sweet. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to sign that. You're supposed to read things before you sign it. Why did I sign that? It's behind here, I think. Here? No. <laughs> Why did I sign that? Perception is reality. Grab. Whoa, what the heck? What the heck? Yo, this is sick. <laughs> this thing is massive. How big can this get? What the heck? That's cool. All right. Oh, shoot. Rook to E4. Rook to E4. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I can jump. Oh, sweet. This reminds me a bit of... Service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. Specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. So I'm asleep. Right. OC. Original content. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, that was rather easy. Oh, wait. Oh, what? Oh, hold on. <laughs> it's so cool. This is so cool. Everything is changing. The perception that you pick up the thing, it changes in size. This is actually a pretty interesting idea. I've never... Oh, that's so cool. All right, let's move on. Two weeks. Nice. Two more days. That's cool. Awesome. Congratulations to all of you. Whoa, I don't like... Whoa. No objects. Why not? Uh, whatever. Okay. What? Whoa, whoa, hold on. Oh, that was actually simple. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty simple. Um, I guess I can take the block back. What's oh, so small? There we go. Okay, we're making progress now. There you go. Can I break something with this? Oh! No. Unfortunately, no, I can't. That's not cool. So apparently I'm dreaming. This is all a fake. This is all not... Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. 
Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. Wow, thank you for reminding me that you do not care. Also, I see a camera there. Nice to see one. A fire alarm there for whatever reason. Math, Adam. Oh, how'd your math test go, Nightmare? What is going on here? Oh, it's oh, it's it's a paint. It's a painting. That creeped me out for a second. What's this? Ooh, we're getting dark and spooky, guys. Just gonna take this out. I'm gonna place this. Oh, this is not that hard. You gotta use your brain for at least five percent capacity. I at least have seven. And now I need to use all 7% because I have no idea what's going on here. Hold right click to rotate. Oh, you got to hold it down and move the mouse. That's cool. Uh, what do I do with this? Oh, I'm going to, I'm going to, oh, I got, I, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it, boys. I'm going to make this boy Jimongous Cheese. Jimongous Cheese, come to us. Imagine a cheese wedge that just keeps getting bigger and bigger. That'd be pretty cool. I like this game so far. It's very relaxing. I don't know if there's a horror aspect to this game, but hopefully not. God, look how big this cheese is. This is a massive piece of cheese. Will it kill me if I... Oh, no. Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. I thought I'd die if I, uh, if I landed on me. No, it's getting smaller. This is, a, this is a really interesting as, uh, aspect or uh, idea for a game. Okay. All right. I think I am Gucci. I think I can go up there now. Yeah. Jump. Made it. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. All right, I'm, I'm I'm asleep, and I see two different clocks here: 15, 42, 12, 5. What's that saying? Some something's blinking there. That was interesting. Okay, not scary at all. Uh. Oh, I have to I have to make this small. Okay, I got to make this one small, just like that. What's this? What's this? It's boarded off and it looks scary. We sh should not enter it. But we will. It's in here. Dream soda. Warning. You have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation. What kind of force are you talking about, lady? Can't make me do shit. Why did that not work? Please use other door. I would rather bloody use this door. Please let me in. That was actually kind of creepy. Oh, this is going to be interesting, boys. Can I not use any of the other buttons? No? Okay. I guess I have to go back. All right. Wait, could I have gone back the uh, soda? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if this soda... Need me. I have a soda here. Let's see. I'm gonna hold on to that. That may be worth something. Maybe. Okay, will you come smaller, please? I need you to get smaller. That's a bit small enough. Fit? It will fit. Come with me, soda. Oh, I can't. Oh, wow. God, I need this thing is. 
Oh. I don't think we're alone, guys. I don't think we're alone. Something broke through there. That's creepy. I don't like this. That was easy. What do I press, though? So if I'm dreaming, I'm having a nightmare, I'm assuming. Okay. Okay. That was really difficult for whatever reason. All environments perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by some, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation and, uh, in your post-procedural survey. Uh, definitely right, Sean. Surveys may be eligible for a gift card. Ooh, a gift card? Why did you say that to begin with? I'll start trying now. I get a gift card. Oh, really? Why not? Well, here's the thing. Somebody brought an item through. Oh, I see. Big brain. All right. What the hell is that? Is that at night? I don't know what's going on here. Hold on. Okay, I'm going to keep going straight. Yeah, I'm not messing with that. Okay. Is there something I can use? Okay, now I'm stumped. There's nothing I can use. I don't, I don't see anything. Oh, wait a minute. That's actually pretty... That's pretty... Uh... Oh, shoot. I need a second item. Oh, I see. I see what we gotta do. Make this Jimungus. Jimungus? I don't know if that's a word. Help Wanted is a pretty cool game, but uh, we got to make this big enough to uh, hit both of them. There we go. Easy as pie, boys. My 7% brain power is working hard. Light recognition on your completion of the Somnasculpt orientation. You did it. To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. There's a brick wall. Oh, there we go. But I can't exit. Something doesn't seem right here. Exit there. gonna open up at all or Ooh. 
How do I get out of here? I... Oh, wait a minute. I think I know. Yeah, I think I know. Okay. Oh! There we go. Oh my goodness, what is going on? So, exit's over here. Now we're getting into the dark part of the game, I'm assuming. This is like the backstage area. We're in the back rooms of a liminal space. I wouldn't want to be that. What's going on here? Oh! Did I just fall? I am. Sweet B. What? Fire alarmist. Didn't work, I guess. Time cards. Oh, soda. Can I have all the sodas? Okay. I don't know how to... I, okay. I don't know what the sodas are for, but that's the second time we've seen that vending machine. I don't like the way this hallway is leading us, guys. This is... This is, <laughs> this is usually when bad stuff happens. Calming music, though. Same, same doors are some doors are best left closed. <laughs> I'm out of the fire extinguisher. Oh, that ever blocks you. Sure, got that right. Should I take this or exit? Oh, it's the door we can use. Whoa! Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that is cool. It's an illusion that it's small or that it's big. That is kind of cool. All right. What's this? Exit temporarily move. Why would you move an exit? It's not cool. It's not cool at all. Oh my goodness. Whoa, that's trippy. Oh, this is trippy. Yeah, this game is really fun, actually. Woo! Okay, I think we're doing good. I don't know. I... Exits that way. Wait a minute, what? Exits this way, right? Okay. It's taking me out for a loop. Yeah, this is not... Not supposed to be here. Yeah, okay. Alright, this is this is not... This is not an exit, guys. This is not something we need to be around. Alright, let's get back into it. Um, let's go to this trippy room. This is really cool, by the way. I, I'm gonna admire that. It's really cool. Really cool idea. Um... Nothing special in this room. Unless it's a liminal idea. This is a 3D game too. Yeah, you're definitely right. Oh, whoa, that tripped me out. <laughs> That's really cool. That jump scared me, even though it probably shouldn't have. Okay, uh, this is not good though, because we're lost now. So let's go back. I guess we got to go back then, right? Yeah. Not that way. Oh, 
this is the entrance. At least the music's really calm. I really enjoy the soundtrack of the game as, as thus far. It's been very calming, very soothing. It's the fake exit. Okay, nothing there. Let's go through the weird hallway. And let's try and find the exit. Maybe it's a door. These? No. Yeah, it kind of does, right? Elevator music? Good music. Elevator music's good music. So far, we've had some really trippy experiences so far. And I'm enjoying every single second of it. Really am. Maybe I have to turn on all the fire alarms, maybe? I don't know. Maybe I'm just overthinking things. But nonetheless, this game is just very interesting. <laughs> I just can't believe the exit's temporarily moved. This is, uh... Jesus Christ. I have no idea where to go. How do I make myself? No. <laughs> oh my goodness. I get to do something with these doors, I imagine. Actually, I think I figured it out. Okay. Yeah, I figured it out. Not the door to the bricks, but I feel like it's this idea. I just need to take the door with me. I left it at the entrance for whatever reason. Okay, let's go. I know what to do with this door. I know exactly what to do with this door. At least I, I'm assuming I do. Let's see if it works out for me. That's a, that, that'll, that'll never get tiring. That's so trippy. No, I can't bring in items. Darn it. Something's up there. Can I move anything? There's someone up here. Oh, wait. Oh, there we go. Nice. All right. Making progress, guys. We figure no! God, I keep dropping it. I got to stop doing that. It's really small. I'm doing great. I'm just playing this wonderful game called Super Liminal. And, uh, I don't know if you've heard of it. I'm sure a lot of people have played it. It came out a couple years ago, so it's not a new game, but it's still an interesting game that uh, I'm enjoying this far. Actually, with that like that, Definitely make it to the center here. Staircon. Is that it? Nothing special? Oh, okay. Well, we got out, we got ourselves out though. That's the important thing. What's this? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk to you about being special. So special, in fact that we have no idea where you are. But not to worry, we're working on it. What? I don't like the sound of that. Working on it? 
Yeah, I don't like the sound that you're working on it, dude. I'd rather not be found. All right. Beep. Okay, I think we're back in the... Whoa! Is it one of those things I have to be at a certain angle? Yeah, I think it is. Yes! Got it. All right, cool, cool. Oh, look, a podium to talk about me being the real leader of the world. No, I'm just kidding. All right. That was actually kind of cool. Perception is the basis of reality. Because you can't perceive what is real and what's not. Unless you have perception. What the heck is this? What is this? So I'm going to have to assume I need to bring up my little... Oh, sweet. Sweet. Interesting. What else do I need to look at? To oh, wait a minute. I see it. Perception is reality. Of course it is. Of course it is. So I'm trying to figure this out. Such as tape. Oh, wait a minute. Hey, I got it. Let's go. All right. Moving out. Ooh. I don't like this because it gets dark and scary. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'm just popping in to give you a quick update on where you are. We still don't know, but please keep moving forward, and hopefully you prefer frequent updates to being reminded that you are completely lost. This is getting creepy, guys. I don't like being in the back rooms of a liminal game. It's like the worst place to be nightmare-wise. Okay. Um, oh, shoot. Okay. Back up. Interesting. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Got the cube. There we go. Picked it up. Oh, okay, we can move forward now. Let's go. Wait. Something up here. I kind of want to. Floor? Please use the other door. What? Okay, I got an achievement. Oh, I got a die. Oh, I got die. What's this? It's a lucky die, I guess. This is so creepy. Huh. Oh, we're outside. Oh, we're upstairs now. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and we All still right. can't find you. But you should now have access to a series of elevators that should trigger your subconscious to gradually wake you up. You should also find a variety of emergency exit signs that should lead you to them. Will all of this work? Absolutely. But yeah, nightmare. We're with you, buddy. All right. Oh, shoot. What is this? What? Why, why is that blocked? What? Okay. So perception is reality. 
has no time on that clock. Nice. <laughs> that is cool. I can use the moon. It's a light. That is funny. That is funny. That is pretty funny. The moon is a light. on here though oh it's uh, this stuff okay I guess I gotta climb out I guess this is weird uh, but you see what I'm doing with the items I'm kind of manipulating them by stepping back and whatever the perception is oh wait a minute oh that's what I needed okay I need this to be small again you that's what I needed all right move up now rip mode no more moon <laughs> that's funny that's a good joke what is septa gonna do now no more moon sorry moon you've been ripped from the sky there's the exit hello my name is Dr. <laughs> Ryan Pierce. I didn't in the event that this elevator does not wake you up Please don't interact with anything that strikes you as psychologically significant, as we will no longer have any way of controlling it. For example, <laughs> if you see your parents, please punch them in the face as hard as you can and immediately run away. Um, all right. I don't want to go into this. Uh, oh, sees the day. Yeah, nice. Oh, God, here we go. It's going to be scary. This is probably going to be the scary part. No scary part. All right. Cool. Oh, come on. I guess this is level four, 4 a.m. Okay. We're back in the suites. Yeah, this is the same suites from before. Okay. Uh, we pull, we haven't pulled green soda yet. Baking soda. Okay. All right. That's oh oh no. This is different. This is an automated message for all patients who attempted to use an alternate pathway to access the next phase of Somnasculpt therapy, but who have become trapped in a dream state paradox instead. Your decisions imply a failure of orientation, which reflects negatively on the standard orientation protocol. You will rectify this failure immediately. Oh God, this is getting creepy. What's that? Hold on. What's this? Whoa. Yo, what the heck? Did I just... What the heck is this? Oh, this is so cool. This is actually really cool. I actually like this. This is nice. The stars are forming something. I just can't figure out what it is. Or maybe I'm just losing it. This is not forming anything. All right. That was a cool little secret that I found. Nice. I noticed something in the side door, so I had to... Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I thought I couldn't fit. I was like, what? That's pretty cool. 
Yeah, it is very pretty. I could just end it here. That's just so cool. You know what? That's going to be the thumbnail of the video when I make it. Such a cool little secret. I love it. like a direct path yeah it is okay you can't just deviate that was cool all right yeah very pretty okay moving on to the main game of horror and fun so let's see Oh, what? Perception is reality. You're friendly, Dr. P.S. We'll get through this. Okay. Oh, there it is. Curators only. Yeah, that's probably going to happen. I'm going to die to a demon in my... Is that Mickey Mouse? No, it's a light torch. Oh, shoot. Something's up there. I want to know what it is. That was cool. I don't know what I did, but that was cool. Let's do more of those things. I'm a very curious person, by the way. If I see something that's like open or whatever, I'm going to investigate it. Horror games do not count, though. I do not do that. <laughs> I'm too scared to do that. Okay, we're in another room. Let it die. Are you lucid dreaming? Please head to the exit to wake up. I am trying to. Whoa. I'm not going to go in there. Wait a minute. What? Really? Expert fire alarmist. I've opened, I guess I turned it like a lot on. The stairs, it was my dog. <laughs> Couch had a dream. I was being attacked by a demon on the stairs and my chest hurt chest hurt and I couldn't move then I heard something going down the stairs it was my dog dude that's like really horrifying F figure out your dog I guess we're good on here oh god all right guys nightmare time professional tip the average adult can only withstand three to five dreams per night once this threshold is eclipsed by entering more dreams, your mind will suffer an explosive mental overload, reorienting you for the emergency exit protocol. Please subject oh, yourself soda. to explosive mental overload. How about let's not and say we did? What are these sodas for? I don't... I can't take a sip of water. What is going on? They look like apples now. Wait a minute. What? That's good enough. Yeah, it is traumatizing a bit, actually. Yeah, it's scary, dude. Oh! That was weird. Trip me out. What's this? Pen. Apple? All right, let's keep going. Okay. Anything I can take or... Oh, what the heck? A 
That's odd. Why would I need to go up there? Let's find out. Oh, what the heck? Never mind. I realized why. I don't want to go in there. I want to figure out there's a way to... anything else I can grab and pull out oh what what that's cool that's it right Thanks. oh I can get up there. Nice. Okay. But that doesn't solve my problem. Wait a minute. Come on. Come on, there's something there that I... Oh, I guess I just gotta do that, yeah? All right, I guess that works. Go down. All the way up here. Please note that a reluctance to volunteer for the risks associated with explosive mental overload implies a misunderstanding of all other solutions, all of which are far more traumatic and likelier to result in catastrophe. I am not capable of suboptimal suggestions. Oh, what? Please exit this dream as soon as possible. That works. Anything else I could mess with? No. Okay. That worked. Oh! Okay, that's weird. Things are falling apart, guys. I mean, not that bad, right? Yeah, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Yep. Oh, there's another. Oh, God. I got to fall down that. Exit is this way, apparently, down the center. Can I get on top of that, though? Slide, slide, slide. I climb that. I thought I did too. I'm pretending I didn't though, Sean. Or a nightmare. You think meme channels deserve play buttons? Eh. Kinda, yeah. Alright, let's just jump down. What? You are here, dream layers in mind. Bart diagram. People only dream of ordinary objects, boring. So are we. Five AM. Guys, I think we're finally losing our minds here. I think we're diving into the layers of dreams, kind of like an in inception. Great movie, by the way. Star Leonardo DiCaprio. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you've just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. 
I feel that. Why do I feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? I don't like this. What the hell was that? Oh! No, 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 no! No! What the hell's going on? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. Oh, no! What the hell's going on? Yo, okay, this is creepy. Why are we in a freezer? There's blood. Oh, shit! That was my phasmophobia demonologist in me. This is becoming a horror game now. What? I don't see anything. Wait. Murder, murder, murder. What the heck is going on? I can't get back out. What do I do? Wait a minute. I think I'm figuring it out. I didn't expect a horror aspect of this game. Jesus Christ. Door closed. That son of a bitch locked me in. Okay. I don't know what to do. Murder beans, murder beans. Oh, shoot. Where am I going? Oh, whoa. What the heck? Oh, wait. There's a side door. Oh, okay. There's a side thing. Die, die. Oh, I get it. Die. So to die, die. I don't like I don't like this game anymore. I don't like this game. Oh shoot! 